Okay, so it's, um, I think it's December 10th. Um, and this is what I'm going to be working on today. So um, I've routed out the slot on the bottom of the boat where the um, soundboard comes through and, and uh, rounded it over. And I'm going to be putting some uh, carbon fiber cloth around this uh, radius here. And uh, so to do that, I've, I've done this on the boat. Um, so the boat, I've, I've uh, basically lifted it up on the pulley system I've had and, and you know, tilted it uh, so that I could get down underneath. I used a um, router to route out the, route the slot out here. Basically just put, um, you know, one, a uh, edge uh, cutting router bit with a little um, little bearing on it so that it, I, and I pre-drilled holes through here so I knew where the um, you know where the center board was before I put the center board trunk into the boat so I was able to just put the router bit you know through one of those holes um, and run it up and down the uh, inside of this and and uh, basically ended up having a nice straight edge and then I put a round a um, quarter round bit on the router and just rounded that edge over so uh, what this assembly is about here is I got to put that cloth in here and um, the nice thing about having the boat this you know basically right side up as opposed to upside down is that um, there isn't going to be any um, epoxy or, or drips or anything like that going up inside the you know, centerboard trunk where it would be difficult to sand or anything like that. So I'm going to be um, wetting out the carbon fiber tape, um, pre-wetting all of this out, soaking it really good, um, pre and then wetting out the carbon fiber tape, tucking it in here all along. And then what I've done is I've made up this little piece of um, quarter inch plywood and I'm um, going to wax the uh, tape here so that it doesn't stick to that. Um, so once I've got the carbon fiber basically up up in here and sitting on this part and and wrapped around the way I want it, you know, it'll stay there just because of the viscosity of the epoxy and everything. It's not going to move or anything like that. But I want to push it tight against um, against the hull here so they don't um, uh, narrow down the slot too much for the centerboard. So then what I'm going to do is basically put this in here like this and then put those wedges in, which will then push down on the um, this little piece that I've uh, hot melt glued to the middle of this that'll push out on that um, so that it will push it tight against this edge and you know basically give it a better bond but also um, make sure that the gap doesn't close up too much with you know with by putting layers of, of uh, carbon fiber on here uh, then once I get it done on this side then I'll basically rotate it over and and do the same thing on the other side so that's the that's the plan with that